my god it's time to cut the grass only thing is if how to make a grass trimmer using an angle grinder maybe or oh angle grinder all right let's cut this crap and find an angle grinder hello friends and welcome to another episode of north Coast files today i'm gonna make um, a how to make a grass cutter using an angle grinder and a broom yeah you heard it right a broom but first and first look at this grass man look at this horrible grass it's all over the place the bastard place you know, and it's not even uniform all right so let's find an angle grinder let's see oh what we have here Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. jackpot man let's see this is an angle grinder and the irony of the thing is called a green tools <laughs> all right so finding an angle grinder and let's get started all right friends so today we're gonna make a uh, grass cutter an, a homemade diy grass cutter using an uh, angle grinder and a broom all right so the parts necessary for this stuff uh, it's an angle grinder as i told you before uh, some kind of uh, here you go washer and nuts and bolts as well maybe we're gonna find some broom this is not it Oof. all right this is it a broom as i told you let's put it there the broomy thing some kind of zip ties here you go a cutter as well uh, and why not a beer to make all the stuff smooth as well all right friends so we managed to gather the parts uh, this is not interesting washer and bolt so let's get started all right friends so we're gonna proceed with the thing you know we have the the angle grinder as well there you go we have the angle grinder we have removed the the circular thing we have the handle as well we're gonna remove the handle and as you can see here we're gonna take the measurement of the of the nuts and bolts as well so this is uh, m8 but yours could be different as well so you're gonna find some uh, nuts and bolt as well that's gonna be the same diameter of the of the, of the handle and then you're gonna need some uh, washer or oh, maybe it let's put a a nut first let's go like this and then we're gonna put a washer nut for extra safety as well so we're gonna put this one here so we have one and we're gonna make another one to have two of them all right friends so we have uh, the two things as you can see here uh probably i, I should uh, i put this one wrong man damn it okay so we have them both made it together we're gonna screw the bastard thing into the the green tool as they said you know and we're gonna uh, have a uh, homemade diy grass cutter you know this grass is making me crazy you know for a couple of days i tried various tools but pff, nothing is gonna do the trick then to buy an uh probably made you know stuff but i thought to myself for these days you know why the hell I'm gonna buy one although they are not that expensive but I can for sure make one in my own style you know the no skill style all right then let's see so I have to manage the bastard thing done here you go we have the thing mounted in you are just gonna screw them all the way in your, into your angle grinder now we're gonna use uh, three here we go zip ties like this one 100 pieces they don't say how long there are uh, maybe it's furnace 4.07 inch Phew, who knows what that means but we're gonna use four of them all right so first one we're gonna secure in place you know the start button mine is going sideways and then off and then on and it goes into this position you know so the first zip ties is gonna secure the stay on button all right friends we have managed the stay on button made it secure so we're gonna cut the thing the excess of zip tie like so all right then 
we're going to use the handle to put it onto the belly of the machine maybe here yeah because this is going to be used as a spacer the the thing the motor is not going to take uh, uh, it's not going to touch the ground and this one is going to be like a spacer all right so we're going to put a zip tie on this end as well all right so we have uh, used two zip ties here to secure the the handle cut the excess as well and now the interesting part how the hell we're going to use the broom all right stay tuned we're going to go to that part straight away all right friends so we have the interesting part as well this is the homemade diy uh, grass cutter using an angle grinder as well and the la pièce de la résistance il y a le broom here you go the broom basically we're gonna put it onto the head of the of the bastard thing here you go we're gonna put it here and we're gonna zip tie the bastard huh <laughs> you didn't expect that one all right all right so we have the angle grinder as well we're gonna use the bastard broom broomy and we're gonna zip tie the, the thing in i don't know if you can see much but believe me this stuff really works man so you, you have the handle there we go. using a creepy broom <laughs> You didn't expect this one, eh? Pass that. All right. Okay, so we have the finishing product. Now, here we go. This is the angle grinder, the broom as well. So it's gonna act as a handle. And with all the stuff you're gonna need now is the mm, the rope, basically. The stuff that we're gonna put in the in the head of the thing, of the bastard thing. All right. So let's find something that is gonna be useful to us. All right, folks, because I'm an electrician, I have all the time, you know, this one, this is like a spare crane uh, used to pull cable through this Copex uh, shielding. So we're going to use this pastor thing or you can buy the proper rope for a, a proper grass trimmer as well. But we're going to use this one. So this project is going to cost you nothing if you have all these parts in your house. All right, so stay with me. All right, friends. So let's see. If you're gonna see something all right we have the machine here we're gonna unscrew this head basically this one here you're gonna put the um, you know the metal discs or whatever so this part here so we're gonna take some kind of this uh, special wire cable whatever it's called basically is used to pull cables through a copex shielding but you can if you don't have this one don't worry you can buy the proper stuff all right where is the cutter probably is no what the hell is it man all right all right so we're gonna insert the thing here you go so we have this thing this washer we're gonna insert it through here and pull it to the opposite hole. Here you go. The length we're gonna adjust it afterwards. There you go. So one, and we're gonna put the, the other one as well. Here you go, friends. So we have them all in. Here you go with the things and stuff over there. So all it needs now to take them apart a little bit and cut them if they're not the same size. There you go. Mm -hmm. This is the thing. We're gonna screw it back to the angle grinder and we're gonna have a proper, no-skilled, homemade DIY, proper DIY, low money, grass cutter. All right, so let's put it to the budget thing and screw it in together. All right, friends, so we have it assembled. We have uh, installed the rope thingy. Here we go. The broom stuff. And now, because it's dark and shit, we will see if we can film now or not tomorrow in the next episode. All right, so 
let's get cracking all right friends so let's test it out to see if this one is gonna work all right so stay with me there you go this is the thingy i tested it before so it works like a <laughs> so it works like a charm we have to make some improvement to the broom electrical broom for homemade DIY grass trimmer but as you can see here the grass is done so I'm guessing it's gonna look nice as well all right stay tuned in the meanwhile thumbs up subscribe share this video because it helps a lot all right see you on the next one see ya